we've come up with a string of challenges to test just how easy it is for rats to get up close with humans. Meet the challengers, Randy and his rodent buddy, Rocky. First test, how small a hole can a rat get through? Incredibly, rats can squeeze through a hole as small as a quarter. The rat's ribs are hinged at the spine, allowing them to temporarily collapse under the pressure. The general rule is, if its head fits, then the body will follow. Better block up those baseboards. Now, will this chasm stop them? Incredible. Rats can jump two and a half feet in the air. That's the equivalent of the average man jumping 11 feet off the ground. Handy for finding food in all those high places. Randy's taking a well-earned breather. But will Rocky take on the high wire challenge? Nice work. Whoa! Rocky nearly fell, but not to worry. He has incredible balance, thanks to his supersized tail. A rat's tail follows a similar principle as a tightrope walker's pole. It works as a counterbalance. If he tips one way, the tail swings in the opposite direction. This balancing technique allows the rat to run across power lines and into your home. Approaching the final curve, Rocky's committing the ultimate phobic nightmare. A rat can scurry up sewer pipes and into your toilet. Rats are excellent swimmers and can tread water for three days. They can even survive being flushed back down because they can hold their breath underwater for three minutes. Rats don't always get a good rap, but when it comes to sniffing out food, there's no home, bathroom or kitchen that's off limits. Which is why Randy and his agile buddies are always just a few feet away. Lunch is on me, fellas.